Burnley vs Manchester City, SAT February 3, 2018 Premier League. Team News. Burnley midfielder Stephen DeFore is out for the rest of the season because of a knee injury. Centre-back James Tarkowski remains sidelined with a groin injury so Kevin Long is again expected to deputise. Manchester City playmaker David Silva is a doubt after suffering a hip injury against West Brom in midweek. John Stones could be back in contention after missing that game with illness, but Gabriel Jesus, Leroy Sane, Benjamin Mendy and Fabian Delph are still out. MOTD Commentators Notes Steve Wilson, including their FA Cup defeat at Manchester City, Burnley have now gone nine games without a win, but they are still well on course for their highest league finish since coming sixth in 1974. Quite a feat. Manchester City might blow apart the Premier League record book. It's far from ridiculous to suggest that they could tie up the Premier League title when they play Manchester United at the Etihad in early April, how they would love that. They could, indeed should, also break the record for the biggest margin of victory in a Premier League campaign, 18 points. How about setting new landmarks for the most points, 95, and the most goals, 103, 2. For City, it feels as though anything is possible. What the managers say. Burnley manager Sean Dyche, it's another chance for us to take on one of the superpowers of the league. We have done well against them over the season. Manchester City are the best side, I think, this season and they have shown that. They are a very powerful side, both home and away. But that's what we love about football. We've seen it at Burnley and outside of Burnley. These challenges are there for you to take and we want the team to take on the challenge. Manchester City manager Pep Guardiola on the title race, there are 13 games, 39 points to play, 4. We have, a lead of, 15. It's not over. We have amazing, tough games to play, for example we cannot deny how complicated it is playing at Burnley. After that we have to go to Stoke City, Goodison Park, we have games against Arsenal, Tottenham, United, Chelsea. Definitely it's not over. Loro's prediction. Claret's boss Sean Dyche would take a point now, but the Premier League leaders have got so many ways of opening teams up that it is hard to see Burnley holding out. Prediction, 0-2. Loro's full predictions VNFL stars Emmanuel Sanders and Josh Norman. Think you can do better than Loro? Predict the score for this match and the rest of this round's Premier League fixtures in our predictor game. Match Facts Head to Head Burnley's solitary victory in the past 18 competitive meetings came at home in March 2015, with George Boyd scoring the only goal in a Premier League fixture, D5, L12. Manchester City have won the other six of their last seven trips to Turf Moor. City have twice beaten Burnley already this season, 3-0 in the Premier League and 4-1 in the FA Cup. Burnley Sean Dyche's side are winless in eight league matches, drawing four and losing four. They could suffer four successive Premier League home defeats for the first time since April 2010. A sixth loss of the season at Turf Moor would equal their entire tally for 2016-17. Burnley are the division's lowest scoring home side, with eight goals from 12 games. The Clarets have not won any of the last 51 top-flight games in which they conceded the first goal, D10, L41. Manchester City City have dropped points in their last two away games, having won their previous 10 this season. They haven't gone three Premier League away games without a win since May 2016. The league leaders have equaled the best record by any club after 25 matches of an English top-flight season. Tottenham also won 22 and lost just one of their first 25 games in 1960-61. Sergio Aguero has scored in each of his last four appearances against Burnley in all competitions, netting six goals in total.